hey people 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 welcome 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 back again to another channel another video now guys this thing it have me a women out to no like you understand me have my kids and she have our kids and we are you know it's just so hard when you have to go do a surgery and you don't know what the outcome will be you just have to open big god to make sure that everything is all right now spice we all know spice of our son and our daughter and she is letting them know that she gonna have to do another surgery them doctor going to have to open her back because she have another hernia now they all thought it was one However, them find out another one is there. You understand, guys? And me are telling us say it's not easy for them because them crying and it's not easy for Spice either. In spite of everything, it's not easy for her because she have fear try to be strong for her children. Them, you understand? She have to try to put out the good face to let them know that mommy is gonna be okay. You understand, guys? So, again, we're going to have to put her in our prayers. In spite of everything, we can't wish bad for nobody. You understand what I say? We cannot wish bad for nobody. Especially when you come on to a situation like this way. We have to go to surgery. We know it's a life and D-E-A-T-H thing. And nobody wants to lose a loved one a family a friend nobody you understand so the most you can do is pray and beg god to bring her through safe and sound just as he did before but guys on the other hand me i wonder if something really goes up or it's a publicity stunt because we know say a time when we did see a pregnancy photo, a, a, a pregnant photo circulating that she is pregnant. Which in me never believe it. Me never believe it. You understand? And only if you know, say, not never. Go so it was of what she has been through and, you know, different, different things. So now, me I wonder if this is a fact or I just forget. The public attention again you understand me i say but me not think she could end around a serious joke there with our kids guys have our little daughter crying our son crying me not think she done around that them serious joke with it with that with our children them more nothing you understand so it just it just so sad as me say me could just pray for her keep her in with prayers I know you guys wanted to stay longer, but you're not going to go back because of school. So I really wanted to talk to you guys and tell them something that I haven't been open about what I'm going through. They may have to open me back up again and do multiple surgeries. Yeah, and I wasn't telling you guys because I never wanted to get worried about it. Okay. But I know that God will carry you through. He definitely will. Mm -hmm. Mom, tell Nicholas. Don't cry, please, because you're going to make me cry. And I've been crying a lot about this. You don't have to cry. <laughs> you don't have to cry. You don't have to cry, son. Trust me, mommy's going to be fine. You don't need to cry. Look at me. So I forgot to wear that again. When I was sick in the DR, he started hearing all these rumors that I died and that I was in a coma was having heart attack so he's having that emotion of feeling like maybe he can lose me they found a di another hernia so now i have two hernias so they will have to repair the hernia and you tell me say i must tell you everything you tell me i mustn't hide nothing from you so that's why i'm telling you guys but i promise when i do the surgery you're going to know and i promise we're going to get through this together amen that's just hard for me if you are put out like a good face and to act like I'm strong and I got this like I really don't even know if I got it you okay Ty? Huh? Mm -hmm. I love you okay I love you too 
I promise I'm always going to be here. By the grace of God. guys so there you hear spice i tell our children them what is what you can see the pain they are already feeling and top of that listen how olivet a cuss her out and i make sure no so yeah what a this cause it for come and a that cause her for, for, for it cause it for come back you understand she a make sure no say how she go about doing her thing just after surgery is wrong and because of all of that why she have a bigger hernia now listen this guys what kind of nonsense is this spice how did not close up at the hole i don't understand what kind of surgery i'm not going to cut you and not close up at the hole i don't understand what you mean another thing if you have hernia again i gotta show you a sign if you have that shit again and you're not well, God will punish you. And God will punish you. Because after you went through so much and almost died, you came right back out, back on stage with your foot up in the ear, busting out by the hernia. You never give your body a chance to heal. So we can understand that if another hernia growing, it's because you never get rid of the first problem because you never give your body to heal. Hernia is something that's caused from force. I don't know if you know that. When my son had got hernia, he had got hernia because they sent him to carry buckets of water over that hill in Jamaica. And that bucket of water that he'd been lifting up, which is that heavy bucket of water, it caused him to have the hernia. Which I had to send, he had to have surgery in the hospital and stay in and get it cut because it was bad. So what I'm saying to you now is the force of you dancing, jumping up and split, and putting your legs up there and you just got out the hospital. That will cause the hernia to grow. Because you go back to the same place and you're putting more pressure on it. So in, maybe you said they never close it back up, but not that they close up, it busts back out through the closing. So you might think that never close it back up, but they close it. Ain't no surgeon gonna do something on you and don't close the spice. You have to understand that earn your cost from strain. And if you go back up and I know you gotta make money and things you gotta do. So guys, there you have it. So the most we can do right about now is just put her in our prayers. If it's so. And as me say, me not believe the spice would then really put her children through children them through this fee and make a publicity stunt you understand i prank them to sell it to, to sell it see their reaction or something i expect she do that so guys i'm gonna say it again if this is so let us just pray for you and make we carry her down because we don't see say it's a different situation she had go in she was in one before and it never pretty it never normal a fight she fight her children and family fight for her fans and everybody pray for her so if i saw be the case we could just pray for her again and hope for the best this is your girl marsha peace out